Welcome to a celebration honouring a great teacher. Kenshiro Abbey Sense of Jubilee Celebrations, 50 years of Aikido in the UK, Crystal Palace, London, 14th of May 2005. Kenshiro Abbey arrived in the United Kingdom in 1955. Although invited as a judoka, Abbey Sensei additionally was an official representative of the Aikikai, carrying with him the written permission of the founder of Aikido to teach the discipline outside of Japan. This celebratory seminar marks the 50th continuous year of Aikido within the United Kingdom. We pay our respects to the memory of Abi Sensei, not only for his Aikido and the work he did to establish the art in this country, but to the memory of a man dedicated to a life and ways of Budo. We sincerely hope you enjoy the full and varied program of the events of this special day. The organizers wish to thank all who have participated in making this event possible. It is our hope that you take away a lasting memory of this historical event, practiced in the truest sense of Budo. The organizing committee, from left to right, Mike Levy, Clive MacDonald, Eric Gillette, Derek Eastman, Henry Ellis. David Hunt was also part of this committee, but he couldn't make it on that day to meet at the Hut Dojo. Kinshrabi sends a memorial event, narration and movie slideshow by Henry Ellis. The event was held at Crystal Palace, which was built in 1854 and it burnt down in the year of my birth, 1936, so don't blame me for that. In its place they built the National Sports Arena, where many of the greatest sporting events in Britain have been held over the past many years. We owe a great deal of thanks to Mr Arnold Davis, President of the Bushido Zazen International, who helped to organise and finance the event. Also, appreciation to Dave Rogers Sensei of the Ellis Schools of Traditional Aikido in New Mexico, USA, for the graphic artworks and posters and souvenir brochures, and also to Aurora Publishing of Albuquerque, New Mexico. One of the posters designed by Dave Rogers another one, which I particularly like, the brochure, this was a souvenir brochure, um, excellently produced, uh, published by Aurora, the first uh, pages inside, Personal uh, post for myself from Dave Rogers. Henry Ellis and Derek Eastman at the meeting at the Japanese Embassy in London um, discussing the event with the Japanese ambassador. The Doshu Marito Yoshiba sent us a letter um, wishing its uh, best wishes for the uh, event. Letter from the uh, Japanese uh, Cultural Center. Clive MacDonald Sensei, who was the event chairman and did a fantastic job of organizing not only the event but the people who were supporting him. The program of the day. The photographs that follow this I've tried to follow as much as possible, where possible, the 
uh, events of the day. The Ta Tamashaki School of Taiko, um, they were there when people arrived first thing in the morning and the first thing you heard as you came into the Great Hall was the drumming. And uh, it was the first time I'd seen this in a Budo event and I just thought it was fantastic. Before the event started, many students were allowed to join in with the drumming and uh, try their hand at it. Opening re Henry Ellis. Herena Gay. The opening ceremony by James Green and Matthew Green. It was decided to open the ceremony with uh, judo because of Abbey Sense's background. The carter was done to perfection. The introductions, all the introductions of the day were done by David Hum. Um, who did an excellent job as compare for that day. The Aikido teachers were Henry Ellis, Hayden Foster, Derek Eastman, Ralph Reynolds, Philip Smith. Hayden Foster Sensei, Henry Ellis, Derek Eastman, Ralph Reynolds, Philip Smith, who was there representing his father, William Smith, MBE, the first Shehan in uh, British Aikido. The warm up was carried out with Eric Gillette. As you can see, the mat was full, um, it was sold out to a capacity of uh, 425. There were many people that we had to turn away on that day. Um, Henry Ellis at the first class. First Aikido session, Henry Ellis. Teaching how to take a knife and how not to take a knife. My good friend Joe Curran. Henry Ellis with his son Rick Ellis, a well known MMA cage fighter. Eastman, Sensi Derek Eastman's son. Second Aikido session, Sensi Aiden Foster. Third Aikido session, Sensei Ralph Reynolds. Presentation of the VIP guests. David Hamm introduces the VIP guests. William Bill Woodsensey, Arnold Davis, Ken Cotier, 
Eric Dollymore, Jenny Earl, Robin Otani, Bill Stops, Ken Wade, the teachers Aidan Foster Sensi, Henry Ellis Sensi, Sensi's Derek Eastman, Ralph Reynolds and Philip Smith. David Ann once again. Bill Woods Sensi, 1930, died shortly after the event in 2006. Bill Woods Sensi was one of the greats of British Budo. Despite his ill health, Woods Sensi was determined to attend as a VIP guest. That was a much younger Bill. He was the uh, London Judo Society um, Judo Champion in uh, 1953, I believe. Despite being very ill at the time of the event, he insisted on attending and paying his respects to Abby Sensi, his teacher. A very brave man and the applause he received on that day was tremendous. We miss you, Bill. Standing are the teachers and guests as they arrive. Approaching from the left is Mr. Matai, the uh, cultural attache for the uh, Japanese Embassy. Mr. Matai gave what can only be considered a very brave speech as he discussed how difficult it was to study martial arts in the 1950s and particularly for Abi Sensi to come to Britain so closely after the war when all things Japanese were hated. Many people, if you were doing martial arts in the 1950s, thought that you were being disrespectful to all those that had died in, uh, in the war. Mr. Matai and Clive MacDonald The uh, kendo demonstration, the uh, karate and bow demonstration by Ken Waite Sensei, who was the first assistant to Harada Sensei in 1963 when he arrived in this country. AI. Mark Eastman, Sensei Eastman's son with Brad Beden. The Jiu Jitsu demonstration, Kudo. The Kudo team did an excellent uh, demonstration on the day, and everybody took a great interest and was impressed. Fourth Aikido session with Sensei Derek Eastman. Sensei Eastman um, remembers all the different styles of all the early teachers and demonstrated uh, Noro Sensei's style, Nakazono, um, Tadashi Abbey. Showing how things had changed over many years. Ralph Reynolds Sensei, General Class, Fifth Aikido Session, Sensei Philip Smith representing Shahan Bill Smith, MBE and Hombu. This is the uh, raffle with the beautiful sword uh, presented by Nine Circles Budo Equipment. Uh, there were many, many prizes, but the sword was the, uh, the prize of the day. Don Bainey, um, a dealer in fine arts, Japanese fine arts that is, and swords. He doesn't deal in, in um, imitation swords or armor. 
but if you're interested he's, he's at Gray's Inn Market off of Bond Street near Bond Street Station he's probably the most knowledgeable man in the UK on Japanese artifacts there's a suit of armor Japanese armor on the left this was before the break when everybody came up to look at the stalls. The nine circle stand. The organizing committee with uh, Rob Peck far left. Sadly we lost Rob just a little while ago, just a few weeks ago. He was the secretary of the uh, Ellis Schools of Aikido. Standing Henry Ellis, Eric Gillette, Clive MacDonald sitting at the front David Hum, Derek Eastman, Mike Levy students of the Ellis Schools of Aikido from uh, UK and abroad Andy Lyon on the left Al Montimar from Dallas, Texas Brad Beden Paul Zolli. George McMaster's on the left with Sensi Foster. Derek Eastman on the right. I'm sorry I don't remember the name of the other man. Henry Ellis with George McMaster has become a good friend over the years. Derek Eastman Sensei. Henry Ellis and Derek Eastman receive uh, the signatures in kanji of uh, Abbey Sensei from Nigel Jones. and Clyde MacDonald with students. A letter from Ken Cotier accepting his invitation to the event. A letter from the British Aikido Board um, politely refusing to attend the event. The British Aikido Board not, did not attend the event um, to pay their respects to Abbey Sensi, the father of British Aikido. The chairman of the British Aikido board was said to have uh, stated to the members of the uh, executive committee that if they asked him to attend this event he would resign. He didn't attend and he didn't resign. Ken Williams Sensi, the first student of Aikido in Great Britain, assistant to Abby Sensi and the national coach for Aikido from the beginning. A great teacher and still teaching to this day. He now t uh, runs an organization, the uh, Key Federation of Great Britain. A note from uh, William Sensi apologizing for not being able to make the event. Ken Cotier Sensi Another one who sadly passed away just after the event. We, the, the fee for the event was £20 a head for the whole day. And all the money that was made went back into the, to the event. And at the end we had £136 left and we, we treated the uh, committee to a meal that night and I think we had to put a few pounds extra out of our own pocket to pay for the meal but it was a great meal and we celebrated a successful event. Fantastic day and a fantastic evening. Kensho Abbey Sensei. Kensho Abbey brought many great Budo teachers to Britain. They were to follow him already established here was Otani Sensei and between them they organized and built the BJC, the British Judo Council. Michigami Sensei came to Britain, Tadashi Abbey Sensei, 
Nakazono Sensei, Noro Sensei. In the center, Hamano Sensei with uh, Abby on the left and Nakazono on the right at summer school, 1963. Hamano Sensei was ninth dan. Pierre Chazan from France who came over with Nakazono Sensei, the true gentleman of Aikido. In 1963, Abby Sensi invited Harada Sensi to the UK. Harada Sensi taught at the Hut Dojo. I used to train with Harada Sensi at the very beginning, and we tr when he didn't have any students, he just arrived and, and uh, he had his own uh, class at the Hut. So I trained with him, and uh, I adapted some of his karate into my Aikido, and he adapted some of my Aikido into his. Uh, karate. Chiba Sensei, who followed later, arriving in Britain in 1966, and he came to the hut um, that year, and then he came back to the hut again and revisited in 2010, meeting Hayden Foster, Henry Ellis, and Derek Eastman. We paid our respects to the dojo. And uh, we had a meal in the in the hot pub, which was very nice and sociable. Tommy Otani Sensei, uh, the Kendo uh, national coach for Abby Sensei. In the last six years since this event, we have lost some dear, beautiful friends. Rest in peace, Bill Reeves Sensei, Bill Wood Sensei. Senses Hayden Foster, Ralph Reynolds, Ken Cotier, Rob Pegg, William Smith, MBE. Thank you for your time and thank you for your interest. Just to finish, on the left is Dave Rogers, St. Henry Ellis, right, Derek Eastman. The co-authors of the book Positive Aikido, telling the true story of traditional teachings in the UK.